So as you might know, I have uh, two cars. One on a Bart 595C that I'm driving now. And the other one, Suzuki Swift Sport, hybrid. They are both 1.4 turbos. They're both quite small cars. It's similar in... I cannot move out here, this is close, so I have to turn around again. Both quite small cars with similar prices. Suzuki Swift Sport is new a little bit and cheaper. In the Netherlands, but in other markets it's the other way around. It depends on the additional tax that you have to pay in the Netherlands for fuel consumption. If you then look at uh, performance, stock performance is also quite close. I'm a firm believer that the base level of parts, big 135-140 horsepower, are no uh, match for the Suzuki Swift Sport Hybrid, which is a lot uh, lighter and faster in my opinion. Also room here, but if you compare it with the 160 horsepower EIE turbo to a watt, then the additional power will come in of course. And it will be more tie on tie if you compare it with uh, a watt with a 180 horsepower power plant, they will just walk away. Clear and simple. If you tune, <coughs> Both cars, they are quite similar in performance in my opinion. Um, Abarth being a little bit more, uh, yeah, if you give them a stage one tune, apart with all the EAE turbos are uh, similar to the stage one. Suzuki Swift Sport Hybrid, which is the Suzuki Sport, Swift Sport Hybrid taking the edge, so it's a little bit faster. Not because it has more horsepower, as in the tune, quite similar horsepower, a little bit less than Albert, but it weighs that less. It is a more mature power plant, also uh, with good torque. The torque of the Albert with the EIE tuned is a little bit higher than that of the Suzuki Swift Sport Hybrid tuned, but the Suzuki Swift Sport Hybrid also has an electric engine to kick uh, in. Not so much horsepower, but it does kick in some. Uh, meters. If you compare um, it to the uh, tuned uh, 180 horsepower part which has a Garrett turbocharger, there's uh, no uh, comparison. A stock 180 horsepower part um, will have quite uh, its hands full uh, versus sta stage one Suzuki Swift Sport Hybrid which has about 170 horsepower about 300 newton meters of torque, whereas the um, Abarth 180 has 180 horsepower, of course. With um, oh no, let's close the roof with about 250 newton meters of torque. So, the Suzuki Sport Hybrid stage one has a lot more torque, whereas um, Abarth 180 has a little bit more uh, horsepower. Also the Suzuki Swift Sport will be a little bit lighter, so quite tight and I will give the edge to a stage 1 Suzuki Swift Sport hybrid over a stock 180 Abarth. If you however tune a 180 Abarth, I think uh, the difference will be uh, yeah, staggering, because then you get about 220 horsepower, 340 newton meters of torque and it's all bye bye. An EIE um, turbocharged um, Stage 1, Abarth, especially that uh, comes from a 160 base, has a little bit more uh, uh, mid-range pull, I think will also beat an uh, Abarth 180 stock. And why is that? 180 Abarth has a little bit more horsepower, but a slower reacting turbo because the Garrett is a lot bigger. And uh, 250 Nm versus 310 Nm in the Stage 1, Abarth 160 EIE. And I think you get almost the same with the Abarth 135, 140 um, EAE Stage 1, but a little bit less mid-range torque and uh, horsepower. Hope this helps. Have a great day. Power Car out.